anchor cables. The following causes are usually to blame for twisted cables. The anchor turned the other way round when it was dropped and the cable remains twisted. A discrepancy in the positional relation between the windlass and the chain stopper. For example, the distance between the gypsy wheel and the chain stopper is inappropriate or they are not aligned, which prevents the anchor cable from passing through normally. The anchor cable has been stretched longer than its original length due to wear, corrosion and the like. The swivel does not work properly. If you are faced with a twisted anchor cable, try to remedy the situation using one of the following methods. Drop anchor again, paying out the cable close to the bitter end, and then heave it in. Pay out the anchor cable after attaching a stopper to it. Use a tool like a crowbar to turn the twisted cable over as the cable slackens. Another way is to put a pad in the groove of the gypsy wheel and the controller. To explain this method, we will use a model. Use a pad to raise the anchor cable. Here we have a twisted cable. As the anchor cable is slowly heaved in, it is raised and the twist is eliminated. Instead of a pad, you can use a wire or hawser. Pull the cable slowly with the wire or hawser and the anchor cable can be raised and twisting can be eliminated. Or put a pad on the gypsy wheel. Then use a chain block suspended from a scaffold to raise and slacken the anchor cable. Twisting can be eliminated while the anchor cable is slowly heaved in. Headway or sternway is normally needed when dropping anchor.